Hey guys, it's NaNoWriMo day 28 and I don't know if you can tell but I've just been bawling my eyes out for the past two hours um, because I just watched um, the stoning of Soraya M and if you have read that book or seen the movie please comment below um, and tell me uh, because I want to commiserate with you. Um, I have like so much empathy for everyone. Like, if you tell me that you scraped your knee in high school and that it bled like two drops of blood, I am like. <gasps> clutching my neck and going, oh my gosh, that's the grossest thing ever, and I can c completely empathize with you, and your pain is my pain, and I'm feeling for you, I am right there. Okay, so think of that as like a scratch on your knee. And then, I'm not giving anything away, because the title already says it, but think of a lady <sighs> half buried in the ground with her arms tied and people are throwing stones at her face and there's blood dripping down and she is like rocked back so much from the force of the pain and it's blood is dripping and, uh, and then chunks of flesh are like falling off and oh my gosh oh it was oh man it was so disturbing and awful and So that's my mood right now, super depressed and um, just, I don't know, I just really, really feel strongly whenever I'm reading something or watching something or listening to something and I know that's one of the things that makes us human and should be celebrated, but it can also be one of the darkest places to be in. It's just that state. Oh, man. Emotions! Feelings! Ah! Anyways, um, another disturbing movie I watched um, was Irreversible, which was a French movie. And this is a bit of trivia about me. If you ask me what's the most disturbing movie um, I've ever watched, I would say Irreversible. And I watched it um, like four years ago when I lived in the dorms with my boyfriend. And um, both of us, we didn't even get 20 minutes into the movie. I don't know if you know anything about that movie, but it is awful. Um... There's a scene where this guy gets his head bashed in over and over and over again. I think that's what gets to me the most, is just, like, blood and guts and gore. First of all, for no reason at all. And second of all, just, like, the repeated motion of, Oh, please stop! God, why? Ah, oh, the pain! And then the other one is a um, man raping a woman um, in the buttocks, which is where I started breaking down crying, and we had to stop the movie. So I don't even know what else happens in that movie, and I don't care to know. I'm surprised I even got through this one. Um, just, I mean, like, if you've seen Passion of the Christ, where just horrible, horrible, really real kind of stuff. So anyways, this is not very fun for you to watch, I'm sure. And it has nothing to do with NaNoWriMo. But then again, none of my vlogs have really been that much about Nano. So, um, I guess I'm talking about this because I needed to vlog today. 
this is um, my emotional state at the moment and um, I'm also just as passionate about movies as I am about books so it means a lot to me so um, I guess you should let me know what the d most disturbing movie you've ever seen is and let's tie this in with writing have have you been able to um, take anything away from it and use that um, in your in your stories or your writing because I mean if you're gonna make yourself watch a movie that's disturbing you might as well get something out of it um, okay well this is a vlog and we've only got two more to go so let's just see how crazy they get alright I won't bore you anymore